Hey, what's up guys? Welcome back to another daily video here at 88 Rotors Off-Road. Today, we're gonna start it off with a 2020 limited Toyota 4Runner. This one's getting a lift, wheels and tires, and keep on watching and you'll see more 4Runners. In order to stage limited models with the factory electric side steps properly onto the rack, we actually have to open the door to bring the steps down. Had to just explain that in case you're wondering why we just opened the door here. Eighty Eight Rotors is located in the city of South Omani, which is about twenty minutes east of downtown Los Angeles in California, USA. If you're looking to get some work done to your Forerunner, reach out to us anytime by phone or message us through the contact form by clicking on the link in the description below. The factory x rays suspension has to be removed and disabled. For the wheels and tires on this one, as you can see, we're installing a set of Icon Rebounds in a 17 by 85 with a zero offset and a matte black finish. We're wrapping it up in a 285 7017 Toyo Open Country AT3. You guys are probably going to hate me and wonder why I even put this in the video, but unfortunately, I did not get to record this 4Runner rolling out. But I did for the rest of the 4Runners, so keep on watching. This next one is coming in for a lift, wheels, and tires. This one's coming in for a Fox 2.0 IFP setup with Old Man Emu rear lift springs. We're also installing some wheels and tires on this one, so keep on watching. Let's get a quick measurement of it and see where it sits on the fender at stock height with stock wheels and tires. For the new shoes on this one, we decided to go with the set of Black Rhino Armories in a 17x9.5 with a positive 12 offset. And for the tires, we went with the BF Good Rich All Terrain KO2 tires in a 285-70-17.
Now let's go back for another rough measurement to see where the fender currently sits now. It was at about 33 inches earlier and now it is at about 37 and a half. Please keep in mind that the vehicle was just brought down from the lift. So once we take it out for a quick test drive and remeasure it, it should sit about three quarters of an inch lower. Here's a magnetic gray metallic forerunner that we installed a Fox setup on as well. Our tech is seen here performing a body mount chop. A body mount chop allows you to fit larger tires and or fit more aggressive wheels. Not only does it do that, it also allows you more room to run proper caster adjustments to improve handling, which most people don't realize is very important for the vehicle. And this is what the completed BMC looks like. With the body mount shop complete, next step is to install the new King's 2.5 remote reservoir coilovers with adjusters. To maximize the performance of the front end suspension, we also installed a set of Camberg tubular uniball upper control arms. The upper control arms also correct alignment angles and give you more room for adjustment. If you guys like what you see here and want to see more, please follow us on Instagram at 88 Rotors Off Road. We post on there daily, both on our feed and our IG stories. Next up, we have another 4Runner that's getting a Fox setup, some machined method wheels, and some new 285-7017 tires. The TRD Off-Road 4Runner on Kings is ready to be pulled out.
Black Forerunner, we're installing these method double standards in a machine finished tier. Tires are the 285-70-17 BF Goodrich All Terrains. As one project ends, another begins. Next up, we're gonna pull in another fifth generation Toyota 4Runner. This one's gonna be a magnetic gray metallic TRD off-road that we're gonna be installing a King setup on. In addition to the King setup, we also installed some cambered tubular uniball upper control arms on here, as you can see. Are the King 2.5 remote reservoir rear shocks with Old Man Emu lift springs. For the shoes on this one, we're installing a set of Method MR312s and a 17.5 with a zero offset. Tires are going to be 285, 70, 17 BF Kidrich All Terrain KO2. And this is pretty much going to be a wrap for today's 4Runner video. Thank you very much for stopping on by and checking us out. Make sure to comment, like, share, and subscribe if you haven't already. Turn on that notification bell also, that way you'll get alerted every single day when we post a new daily video. I'm not sure if I'm going to be able to find time to do another video to publish tomorrow. So, I'll say it now. For all you fathers out there, happy Father's Day.